to return to patrol. I just gotta wait. Tell me about Santo Domingo. People tried to get a foothold here. Corpos, gangs, none of them made it. But real people live here in Arroyo and Rancho Coronado. Can't pull the wool over their eyes. Hmm. We are the blood and guts of this city. Why El Capitan? Just like the people are great. Hang on, gotta go. Okay, I'm back. Talk. The people... Well, they're grateful. They show me respect. Wow. A true altruist. Corporal worlds and disease. Power's gotta get back in the hands of the people. And we'll do it. You'll see. How's biz? I don't care for the word biz. I call it work. Hard work. Honest work. And I can't complain. We'll talk later. Mm. Looking for a friend. Booker Updike. I want to invite you here. Please. Fuck off! Uh, uh, huh? You tall white guy? Yeah. Uh. Don't let me get in your way. 
Looking for a friend, Booker Updike. Talk another time, talk? Marco. As you like. Well, I have the beta acid. I still got no clue what happened with Booker. Suspect remains in the vicinity. 
Suspect's vehicle has been located. Details have been sent. Blue table? We got to get rid of it. Really? It's pretty massive. V. Nice to see you. Okay, sit. Sit. You want a beer? Wouldn't mind one. Salud. A lot of time has passed. How you been? Been better, to tell you the truth. What is happening? That night, when Jackie fell. Let's just say things haven't exactly been easy since. Yo sé cómo te sientes. Todos lo sabemos. I am in the middle of preparing an ofrenda. There is still so much to take care of. I want to take part in the ceremony, but... I want to do it the right way, in line with tradition. Mm-hmm. But something I'd lay by his casket, that would do justice to his memory, I... I don't got anything. Mm. But your heart is in the right place, mi niño. Don't worry. He's symbolic. Look for something in his garage. His past is all there. Jackie had a garage? He used it for his motorcycle, mostly. But not so long ago he moved in. You'll find something there, I'm sure. You won't mind me digging through his stuff? No, mijo. He's gone and funerals are for the living, not the dead. Toma, take the key. Thanks, Mama Wells. Ah, don't mention it, V. You have respect. I admire that. The garage is on Republic. No hay de baby. Hi, V. What are you doing here? Sitting and waiting. And yeah, waiting for him. Though I know he's never coming back. Lately, I've just been coming here to sit. An hour. Sometimes two. I know it's gonk, it's just... I miss him. A lot. Wanna sit? Catch up? Hardly gonk at all. Just, well... human. I guess. Jack talked about you a lot. Always saying how much you meant to him. Did he really say that? I bet he used different words. Maybe. But that's what he meant. I really believe that. You actually got to know him. The real Jackie. Everybody else thought he was a goofball with a rough-hewn face and an edge. But they're wrong. No, Jack was a little of that too. Always looking on the bright side. He wore his heart on his sleeve, and wasn't at all afraid to live fully. Had his inner demons, though. Who doesn't? Exactly. They're what makes us who we really are on the inside. There's a huge chunk of his past in there. Mama Wells is having a send-off for Jackie. I need to find something he really cared about. Mind giving me a hand? I'm not sure I should go in there, V. Still too soon? No, it's not that. Mama Wells and I aren't exactly on the best terms. She wouldn't want me touching any of his things, disturbing the memory. That I know. Jackie would want you here. That's more important. Come on.
locked. I wonder what's in there. That's his lair. Slept there. He must have had a different key. Let's look around. Might be tucked away somewhere? Basketball signed by Dante Gonzalez. He was from Haywood, too. Everyone here shot hoops. Dante ran circles around him. I think he might have been the first kid to ditch the Valentinos. Like Jackie. Mm-hmm. They both wanted more out of life. Dante's captain of the NC Blackouts now. Still full. His favorite. Strategic reserve. No touching. How come? ¿Por qué no puedes tocar una reserva estratégica, va? Guess no man caves complete without some of those, huh? He said they're collectibles. They don't print them anymore. That's definitely why they're up there, yeah. Jackie loved to pump iron, didn't he? He called it his form of meditation. He used to say, barbells are the best listeners. They understand all your problems and never give you gonk advice. Gotta be hanging here since 2020. Hmm. This'll be... fitting. Well, you got something for your ofrenda. But we could look around a little more. Found it. Oh, Jackie. That a mandala? Mm hmm. Oh. It's a long story. Hey, you all right? I'm so much better than all right. I once told Jackie he should sweep all the dark energy out of this place. A sand mandala would do the trick, for example. He told me that out of sand he'd build a castle, a home, the Wells family hideout, stronghold, something. I guess you made a bigger impression than you thought. I guess I did. Isn't it just a little, uh, janky? It's hideous. But it's also the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. Nice still. It's gotta be Jackie's dad. Old school ganger. Valentinos, of course. Did you meet him? No, I only ever heard about him. Jackie's favorite tequila. But he didn't exactly inspire many oh, fond still memories. Sealed. It's his lucky charm. One of the first bottles ever made by Jesus de Abajo. What? The founder of Sanson Tequila. Only a hundred of them left in the world. All owned by the one percent. Well, how'd Jackie get this one? It used to be some shriveled abuela and in Mexico. Taco sold it was to him. told him his fish. A dwarf shark. Like Mini. Sounds like a mighty expensive fish. <laughs> oh, I don't think he bought it. Better get going. Actually, V, I think I'll stay a while. Say bye to him here. My deepest condolences. He was a fine boy. Then go raise a glass to him, Padre. A few glasses. De acuerdo. V, it's good you're here. Maybe. We're about to start. 
Sit down, please. I thank you all for coming today. I'm not going to tell you what kind of man my son was or lament about how much I miss him. Instead, I'll tell you a story. When he was about 19 years old, Jackie was in the Valentinos. They were at war with Maelstrom back then. I get a call from the hospital. They tell me he got shot three times, just by the heart. He was conscious when I get there. So many tubes coming out of him. He looked like a like a pulpo, like an octopus or something. He tell me, he said, No te preocupes, mama. Look, I'm bulletproof. Nothing bad will ever happen to me. And when I go, he take off his Valentino's ring. He swear he won't need it anymore. But he was not scared. He just didn't want me to worry. <laughs> Descansa en paz, mi hijo. Among the membership of the Night City Devils Boxing Club, we had this saying, make your best friends among the fighters who knock you out cold. And it's true, Jackie's arm was a cannon. No one's ever hit me as hard. <laughs> I can still almost feel it. Twelve rounds, buddy. Me mandó Camporta. Lamenta no estar aquí. Todavía le quedan cuatro años que cumplir. Me pidió que leyera esto. Recuerdo cuando Jackie se nos unió. Era un niño fuerte. Cuando decía que iba a hacer algo, cumplía. Tenía olor, ol, 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 honor. Podría haber llegado lejos. Mis condolencias a la familia. Que descanse en paz. Anyone else? I, uh... I often think back to the first time me and Jack met. It all started when he put a heater to my head. Then some badges showed up and beat the shit out of us both. It's half my fault, half his. And we hightailed it out together. Half an hour later, well, we're eating dinner at Mama Wells. Turned out to have more in common than we thought. Principles. Jackie Wells. Best friend you could ask for. Loyal to a fault. Once he set his mind to something, he was ready to die to achieve it. He once told me, Broder, the one thing we can't do is be afraid of others. He kept Haywood in his heart, always. It made him who he was. But most importantly, Jackie loved life and had no fear. Hard on his sleeve, he didn't overthink things just went for it. Thought he was bulletproof. And, and that he'd become legend at the afterlife. And ultimately, he did what he set out to do. Shit in the shoes of some powerful people. And if he's watching, I bet just about now, he's flipping them all the bird. Haywood kid with a hell of a drive. 
Rest easy, Chiu. I would like to say a toast. Or mi hijo. Thank you for your kind words, V. I'm glad you're here. It was a beautiful friend that we gave you. Would you, know, you another? For Jaquito? Poor. For Jackie. Amen, brother. I'm gonna miss him. Already do. <laughs> Me too, cabron. Me Campos too. All torn up. Here's to Jackie. He he Got like off to greener pastures. I wonder if he'll be as torn up after you die. Oh, Chingado. Don't go starting something, eh? Not today. I'll see you, Vic. Sure. Hang in there, kid. Here to say goodbye to one of your own, Padre? I'm here to say goodbye to a good man. I'm gonna move on. Go with God. Thank you. I'll take such good care of it. Cuídate, be. Hey, you! Have a drink with us, hmm? To Wells? How'd you meet Jackie? We started out together. In the Valentinos? No, in the fucking Bible Book Club. Yeah, I got only good memories of him. Rest easy up there, brother. I think we might know each other. Gustavo Horta. V. Yeah, I've heard about you. Well, heartfelt condolences, friend. From me, Campo, and all the Valentinos. Thank you. All right, why not? To Wells. May he rest in peace. Good for now, thanks. See? You gotta know when to stop. Nah, right, give me a break. All right, let's go. Ah. Oh, oh. Claire, are you coming? I'm already here. Great. Be there in a flash, promise. Right on. See you soon. Wait, hold up. Which rig are we using? Mine. No argument there. Be right over. Later. I bet a bundle on our win. Losing's just not an option, eh? Hey, look, Samson. Fresh meat. <laughs> Be embarrassing to lose to a rookie. Hey, V, good to see you. So how's it look to you? NC badges are okay with this? NC badges can't see a problem around the stack of Eddie's put in front of them. Solve every problem, don't they? Mm -hmm. Eddie's. Mm-hmm. Any tips before we roll? Don't take your foot off the chew. My job will be to slow everyone else down. Ultimately, it'll be speed, not firepower, that'll win us this race. Go fast. Got it. Oh, take the shard. We need to hit all the checkpoints or we'll be disqualified. 
you want to hang a bit, do. I'll be in the rig. When do we start? The shard. It's all on there. Out of the final. Fuck! 
Let's hold up at the finish line a minute, just in case. You got it. You do this for the eddies, the winds, the glory? Why do you race? It's like you've got laser focus. You don't like winning? Depends on what I stand to gain and what I gotta put in. Yeah, price can be pretty high. Did you say you lost your last driver? Can we not talk about it? Yeah, sure, sure. Need a lift to the shop? Yeah, sure. All right, let's go. We'll talk later.
you and me, face to face. This spot. Didn't pick it at random, I guess. Guessed right. Wanted to show you something. Means a lot to me. Could help put some things in perspective. And it means I trust you. Come over here. So what's so special about this place? Lived just two blocks off while I was here in NC on assignment. Locals come here after sunset. Fire up grills, crack open beers, talk about nothing in particular. Swing by here come evening sometimes. All of it. Every inch is special. Reminds me of Brooklyn. Actually from there. You're in to go back. Can't rewind the clock, V. By the time you realize you miss something, it's usually too late. Attack on Myers. You schemed it up with Hansen. I know that. Yeah. Neural Matrix was pricey. But honestly, I... I never thought he'd try to kill her. You betrayed her. Not just her. Nothing went according to plan. What a fucking mess. So what was your plan? For you to rescue Myers while I secured the AI Matrix. And for us to run. All before Kurt caught on. Now Hansen's changed the terms of our deal. They'll make him answer for the attack. He knows that, so he's covering his ass. The one thing he doesn't know is what's on the Sinusher mainframe. He's hoping it's data he can use as leverage against the NUS. Says that's my ticket to freedom, but... As soon as he gets his hands on it, I'm dead. I just know it. I fucked everything up. I know, V. But I had no choice. Still don't understand why. It wasn't any other way. Honestly. Wouldn't have resorted to this if there was. From Myers, the NUSA, I'm just another weapon in their arsenal. A tool for reaching beyond the Black Wall. And weapons and tools. They don't get to make decisions, or choose to retire. Sounds... Sounds painfully familiar. Think I know how you feel. I doubt anyone understands this feeling as well as you do, V. You're the only one I can trust with this. Only question is, after everything you just heard, you feel the same way about me? feeling this is the first time you've been honest with me. Yeah. With you and myself. I need to get away. From Kurt, then USA, Reed. From everything. Night City's just a pit stop along your escape route. That was always the plan, wasn't it? Yeah. It's just... Things got complicated. Messy. Certainly didn't expect my old agency chooms to get involved. Or to find myself caged by Kurt. I'm fleeing, V. Gotta get out. And to do that, I need you. Cause you... You know how it is. Okay. Say I believe you. What's the next step? We go through with the mission. Grab the neural matrix. While Reed and Alex grapple with Hansen, we make our getaway. And then?
You helped me skip town. I already cut a deal with the Black Clinic far, far from Night City. There, the Rippers can access the Matrix and use an algorithm to create a prototype of our cure. They'll need me present to run their tests. The moment they're finished, I'll send word. And... that's it. Everything. Like a weight off my shoulders, honestly. Now, I have to ask. You're in this because you understand me? Or because I promised to save your life? I understand you. Believe you. Know what it's like to fight for your life. Every minute of it. Gives you a new perspective, doesn't it? <sighs> I guess that's all. I suppose you should call Reed. Let him know all set for the meet with Hanson.